Hold on, we're starting up our smart board. You guys can wait, they can have a little video. Hi! Okay, let's start it up. When the smart board comes down, we'll be able to see things here. Hello, my name is Alexis, and my name is Emma, and we're looking forward to have fun on Mystery Skype with you guys. Now let's have some fun. Hey, hi guys! Hi! hi. hi. <laughs> okay. So you want to do three questions and then guess and then kind of go with that format? Hi guys, do you guys want to start with your three questions first? Hello, my name is Robert and I would like to ask you, are you east of the Mississippi River? Are we east of the Mississippi River? Look at your graph. Yes. 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 That was a good question. <laughs> they just marked out the entire life is Does your state border the Atlantic Ocean? Does our state border the Atlantic Ocean? Does our state border the Atlantic Ocean? No. No. They'll do one more, then they'll guess where we are, and then we'll take it. Those are two really good questions. Are you in the central time zone? Are we in the central time zone? He's going to look it up and so is this. That's a great question. Remember, the times are different across. Can we maybe even search Ohio time zone? No, 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 no. 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 All right, so your turn. So you have three, uh, three questions for us. <laughs> no, I think we'll ask that do you have three questions for us? Okay, go ahead. Say hi, I'm China. Hi, I'm, I'm Janet, and I would like to ask you a question. Does your state border the Pacific Ocean? Yes, we do border the Pacific Ocean. Hi, I'm Emily, and I'd like to ask you a question. Does your state border another country? Yes, our state does border another country. Does this state border Mexico? Yes, our, our state does border Mexico. So I believe this is a good time to guess. Is your state Ohio? 
Kyle. I, I, I believe, I believe um, you you have a guest too. So why don't you take your guest because I think you know who we are. Is your state California? Yes. 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 Okay. Um, Christian, ask number twenty for me. We're gonna, we have one more question for you. I'm going to have a student ask a question. One more question. So. Do you have a student named Leila Salaskar? Do you have a student named Lila Salaskar? How you doing, Layla? Surprised? Nothing like Lake Erie or Lake Huron. We have like smaller, smaller lakes. The the biggest body of water that's near us is the Pacific Ocean. Oh, okay. So not like that's where we have like Erie. Yeah, yeah. Not like not like when you go to the when you go to the lake and you cross the street over there in Salida, right there. You don't. Um, you know, it's a smaller lake. You can see the other end of the lake. Kind of those kind of lakes here. Not like Lake, Lake Erie where you still can't see land across from the lake, if that makes sense. Right. Ms. Alistair, are you from around here originally? Yeah, I went to, uh, I went to uh, Shore Junior High in 7th, 8th, and 9th grade, and I graduated uh, Mentor High School uh, in 1991. And, Layla, and, and Layla's, Layla's, dad is, Layla's dad went to uh, Lake Elementary, too. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Hi, I'm Lila's best friend. Hi, Lila's best friend. Emily, they are together all the time. Emily and Lila are all the time. Um, can I see all of her nine and six goals? I'm sorry? Can they look in all of her nine aunts and uncles? <laughs> I don't know. You have to ask okay. her. <laughs> uh, this is when the best friends come out, huh? Get some. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Any more questions for us? Anything you want to know about our school or our day or? So what's your time? No, we're gonna let you finish. What time zone are you? We are in the Pacific time zone. So right now, right now it's eleven o'clock here. We haven't had our lunch quite yet. Yes. Where's two o'clock? Where's two o'clock? Yeah, where's two o'clock? Yeah, you probably, uh, you probably get. 
Yeah, you're probably getting ready to uh, end your day here soon, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Any other questions from Let's see. Um, do you live in an urban, suburban, or rural area? We live in suburban area. We live in suburban area. So it's a tough word. <laughs> so do we. So, um, yeah, we're just so you know where we're at a little bit more. We're, um, we're just uh, east of Los Angeles. We're in Southern California. Uh, so we're um, east of Los Angeles. So we're actually in Covina, California, if you want to look us up. We are Roland Avenue Elementary. So if you want to look us up and find out where we're at. But uh, also we're near Pasadena, uh, where the Buckeyes came and played the Rose Bowl a couple years ago. So... And, and one of the questions we wanted to ask you, we didn't get that far, but uh, what is one of the uh, most popular sports in Ohio? Football. <laughs> <laughs> what is the most popular, um, popular sports is football. Um, what is your popular sport? Iowa's popular sport is baseball. Yeah. Yeah, base, ba baseball is pretty popular. Soccer is pretty popular too. Um, yeah. So when um, so when when I got I want to get my students' attention. One of the things I do is I go O H Iowa. We love that. <laughs> so. Yeah, we have uh, we have our Ohio State flag uh, hanging outside our classroom, and so we kind of adopted some of the Ohio State, Mr. Salisbury's uh, favorite team. So, you have any questions for them? There you go. Where is our school? What city? What city? Um, what is the weather um, in California? Hot, 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 very hot. Yeah, it's it's hot. And we had a quite a heat storm um, last week. We got uh, up to 105 uh, a couple weeks ago. Right, right now, it's about you know 85 ish. It's been kind of nice lately. Does it snow in California? No. Maybe rare on hail. Yeah. Oh, in the mountains, yeah, but like where we live down here, no. Maybe rare hail. A couple of years back, we had hail. Yeah, we did. Yeah, we had a, we had a uh, freak um, cold front come in and uh, cause some little little hail. But other than that, we don't get a lot of snow. Uh, only in the mountains. Um, so Mr. Salisbury only sees snow when he comes back to Ohio in the fall. Okay, you ask your question. Okay. What city is your school in? Central Ohio. Central Ohio. Okay, we all answer at once. It's hard to hear. Okay, so we are from Metro. It's um, about 20 minutes east of Cleveland, Ohio. And you're right on. Uh, you're right on one of the big major uh, Great Lakes, aren't you? Which one's that? <laughs> we are on Lake Erie, and if you walk to the entrance of our school, you just about see Lake Erie from our school. It's really cool. Yeah, I used to ride my bike along uh, up to Lake Erie. <laughs> Is your school indoors or outdoors? Like, uh, like uh, are, are are the classes like, like, indoors, like, like in, in a big building or like in in like sort of like scattered around um uh, school campus? What a great question! Because I only see school campuses like that on TV. Because in Ohio, it we have crazy weather. We could have snow. Rain and the next day could be warm. So here we have all of our classes inside. It is about every school I can think of. It's 
the indoor school with all the classes inside. Kids don't walk outside unless they're going to recess or out to the bus. Uh, <laughs> How about okay. you guys? We are an outdoor school like a, like a, we were in outdoor school, like the, the, the classes are scattered all, all over on, on our... When we, when we walk out our door, we walk out. Outside. Yeah. We walk outside. Wow. Outside. So we're gonna, so he's gonna open up a door, and so as soon as we walk out the door of our classroom is the outside. So we have little awnings instead of instead of our you would have hallways. Uh, we have little awnings over our hallways, but it's outside. So if we were to go from class to class, we would go outside and then uh, go to that classroom outside. So um, because we are warm weather all year. Um, it's kind of like summertime year-round here, and so um, we don't need to have uh, a lot of indoor um, schools, so to say. Wow, we're really coming. <laughs> cool. you, uh, you, you, you okay with a couple more questions, or are we good? Yes. All right. You want to hand me? What time do you guys start school? Oh, yeah. We start school at 8.35 for about grade. And then we end school at about 3 o'clock. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. All right. You want to tell them what time we end? Okay, I'm going to have Melissa come up and tell you what time we start and what time we end. We start school at 8.20 and then end at 2.17. Oh, so that's fairly close up for practice, okay? Yeah, about, about 20 minutes. About 20 minutes more, yeah. One, uh, one time we Skyped with a school in Oklahoma, they went till 3.30, so, but they, and they started at 8.30, so they had a longer day than we did. Okay. Uh, any more questions for us? Yeah, if you guys have time, we'll have a couple of questions. Yeah, we do. Uh, do you have like safety patrols at your school? We have student patrol. Uh, and we make sure that like kids are be nice and playful and don't run so they won't get hurt. Same deal. Thank you, Nicole. So some, some cylinders, uh, actually that, that was Desiree and she she leads the safety patrol team, so you were talking to the right person. <laughs> what kind of electronic devices do you use We use Chromebooks and iPads. Same thing we use. We use Google Drive for writing. We also use Google Drive. Maybe we could share something within Google Drive. That would be really nice. Yeah, we can do uh, cross country editing. We can edit each other's writing and stuff like that. So. That would be great. Yeah. Do you guys use Kid? Do you guys use Kid Blog? No, we don't. But I do have an account, so that would be something they would love to do with that. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, we've used uh, Kid Blog this year too. So. What kind of extracurricular activities do you have this school? Extracurricular <laughs> When do you guys start school and when do you... Is there any extra, any extra things we do here at the school? Are you, talking about, are you talking about like clubs or sports or anything? Yes.
We have um, Kids Corner and Homemade Club. Did you say Homemade Club? No, we have home, we have a Homework Club. We don't have a lot of sports or after school activities here. Um, Mr. Salskar is looking to maybe start a Minecraft one next year. We'll see. Oh, We do Christmas, Halloween, and um, then the school parties. I saw Layla got an award the other day, a couple about it last week. Congratulations, Layla. Uh, we got a couple more. At your state, do you build any cars? Uh, if I if I remember right, there's a big one in Toledo that makes Jeeps, right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Mr. Salskar spent ten years in Toledo, so he makes that. <laughs> uh, one more. We gotta let them go. What day do you start school? When we get back from summer break, we got really happy. Yes. August twenty. How about you? August, we start August 25th. Yeah, yeah since you guys end a week early, you start a week early. So, uh, Any more questions for us? Does it sound like you miss Ohio often? Uh, yeah, we tried to make it back for uh, a couple trips. So we were recently back uh, around uh, 
Thanksgiving time. But we definitely want to stay in touch uh, as far as, you know, working on kid blog and writing, if, uh, whether it's this year or uh, next year, if uh, Miss Land has uh, uh, new students or she keeps some of her students, I don't know. Um, but uh, we we'll definitely want to stay in touch and um, and do some cool things across the country. Yeah, that sounds great. I won't have the same students next year, but they will be in fifth grade, so we could um, show those to your practice this site also, and they can contact them in your classes as well. That's that. That'd be awesome. Yeah. So I'm. Uh, I do want to say that I'm very, very uh, impressed with how Mentor is uh, using social media, especially Twitter and. Uh, I just found out that uh, some of my teachers uh, that I had at Shore Junior High and high school are retiring this year, uh, and I only found that out through social media and the uh, way Mentor uses it. So I'm very thankful for that, so that way I can write to them and say say congratulations on their retirement. So so uh, kudos to Mentor. Um, I'm glad we were able to make this special and surprise Layla. And it was very special for me, and I've recorded it, so I'll share the recording with you guys. and. Um, and put it up on our website, and you guys can take a look at it and watch it later. That sounds great. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye, bye, guys. Bye, Layla. Bye, bye, guys. I love that they are both.